In this video, we shall design a shell and tube heat exchanger using LMTD method in engineering equation solver software. Uh, so here is the problem statement. A shell and tube heat exchanger with 12 shell passes and 12 tube passes is used to heat water from 20 degree C to 70 degree C at a rate of 4.5 kg per second. Uh, heat is supplied by hot oil uh, which is uh, anything into the shell side at 170 degree C at a rate of 10 kg per second. Uh, we are given the overall heat transfer coefficient which is 350 watt per meter square per kelvin and we are asked to determine the heat transfer surface area on the tube side. So uh, I am opening the engineering equation solver software. So this is the interface of the engineering uh, equation solver software. Uh, here we have to enter all the given data uh, and the required equation then we shall simulate and uh, we will uh, determine the surface area the required surface area so i am entering all the data that is given in the problem uh, like we are given the inlet temperature of the cold stream so Tc n is equal to 70 degree C. Sorry, this is uh, 20 degree C. Outlet temperature is uh, of cool fluid is uh, 70 degree C. We are also given the mass flow rate of cold fluid, so I am writing this m dot underscore c, and this is a four point five kg per second. We are also given the CP of the Code to it. So here the CP C is four one eighty joule per kg per degree C. Now uh, I'm going to calculate the uh, heat capacity fluid for the cold fluid. So this is uh, M. Control C, Control V, and steric M dot C, steric CPC. This will calculate the uh, heat capacity fluid for the cold fluid. Similarly, I will now enter the data for the hot fluid. So to save the time, I'm just copying all those expression, and uh, yeah, you may type uh, by pausing the video in your own software. We are uh, given the inlet temperature of the heart fluid, the mass flow rate, the CP, H, and uh, now I have calculated the heat capacity of rate of heart fluid here. We are also given the overall heat transfer coefficient. As uh, we are given the heat capacity of rate for the cold fluid and the, its inlet and outlet temperature, so we can easily calculate the heat transfer in the cold fluid so let me call this q is equal to c underscore c is steric t c out minus t c n so this is the heat transfer uh, from the hot fluid <coughs> to the cold fluid now uh, as we will use the LMTD method, so we also need the outer temperature of the hard fluids. So I can use this expression C H is steric T underscore H N minus T <coughs> underscore 
h out so this q is actually the heat given by the uh, heart to, to the cold plate so i have taken that heat uh, to calculate the outlet temperature of the uh, heart plate so now we will uh, uh, find out the lmtd for the lmtd we will determine the temperature difference at both ends of the uh, heat exchanger so now i am writing expression for the delta t1 and delta t2 So delta T1 is TH out minus TC1 and delta T2 is TH in minus TC out. Now we shall uh, find out the log mean temperature difference. This is given by the delta T1 minus delta T2 divided by ln delta c1 by delta t2 so this expression will be, uh, find out the log mean temperature difference will determine the log mean temperature difference and now we will enter the Newton law of cooling to determine the heat transfer area. A is, A is the surface area which we are going to determine the LMT T. So we have put all the equations and all the required parameter. Now, uh, sorry, we have forgotten one parenthesis here. Now I will check that if the equation are correct so uh, there are 16 equation and 18 variable so it means that uh, there is uh, some problem yeah actually this is uh, delta t underscore one and this is delta t underscore two as we have defined this with the delta t underscore one delta t underscore two and now let me check yes now we have 16 equation and 60 variable no syntax error okay now click on this uh, calculator icon and here we go uh, here are the values of all the variables that uh, the, all the parameters that we have entered in uh, in, in the, we have entered in our, uh, our software so this is the surface area 25.72 uh, meters square we are asked to determine the surface area and uh, these are the values of the other parameters LMTD, the MC, and so on. Thank you very much.